Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be showing you some new and improved ways to export your data from Trello. Uh, so if you're one of the 25,000 plus users or boards that have this power up enabled, then this should be of interest to you. And as a special treat, I'm going to be asking Yanina to run us through these. Uh, she's the product manager and the brains behind these new features. So with that, I'll pass it straight over. Hey guys, my name is Jan Nina and I'm the product manager here at Aura Apps. So yeah, let's get started. Here is my demo Trello board and you can find the board export power up here on the top menu. First, you need to select which lists you want to export. I'm just gonna export all of them. And now I can show you the new features. So we have three amazing new features on board export. Um, first of all, we have added more fields that you can actually export. So the board contains a lot of different items and we have expanded the support to cover more of them. Um, on top of that, we have also allowed all our users to customize the selection, what they want to have included to the export file. So for example, I'm just going to choose the export PDF and choose all of those fields for now. And the last but not least improvement that we have done is we have actually improved the export format of the PDF as well as the Excel format. So I will show you them in a second. I'm going to now export the PDF with all of these selected items. And here you can see how the PDF exported file looks like. So it corresponds to the card quite, quite similarly. And uh, one page is always a card. Here you can see all the items that I selected are supported from the card, including description, also the formatting, you get your checklist and their progress, as well as comments. So this helps you to share this file for example, within your team or, or within management, if you need to report back what's going on in a specific card. And now I'm going to show you the Excel export. I'm going to select all of these fields and then select Excel. And again, I can now select which items I want to export from this board. I'm going to select all of them. Once you're happy with the selection, you can click export. So here you can see each of those columns are items from the board and each of these rows are cards. You can get a lot of information, all of the items that you chose inside the app. You can get all of them nicely organized into these columns. And the latest update we have added is that you can actually include all your attachments as well as comments. And here is a link which directs you to that cards, comments and activity. This helps you to keep in track what kind of conversations might have happened inside the card and what kind of activity the card has gone through. So this Excel export helps you to organize the data if you want, even manually inside this Excel file, and again, share it with your team or just to keep track on, on your board and have like an archived version of it. And that's it for this time. I hope you will enjoy these features. All right, thanks Yanina, that was great. I uh, hope that was helpful for everybody else as well. And if, you're, if you have Board Export already, you can go ahead and use these features now. Uh, however, if you are brand new to it and you wanna give it a try, then it's really easy to install. Uh, all you gotta do is just head over to Google and put in Trello Power Ups like this. And then you can just type in Board Export and it should come up and there you go just hit add power up and you can get started so yeah hope that was helpful if you guys enjoyed this video uh, and you want more tips and tricks for how to use trello then uh, make sure you hit like on this video and subscribe to the channel and you'll be notified as and when we roll out new videos so hope you enjoyed that one and we hope to see you next time